hey y'all welcome back to my channel so i was gonna do this in a separate video but i think i'm just gonna go ahead and include it with the vlog today is sunday you guys and i wanted to let you guys know about this company this video is not sponsored once again it is not sponsored for the last umpteen time it is not sponsored no <laughs> so y'all let me tell y'all about this company i tried this video earlier but it didn't come out exactly how i wanted to so let's get on into this video so i can tell you about this company so the name of the company is called thompson now this company is good for i would say youtubers who are starting out whether you have five subscribers 15 subscribers 200 500 7 000, 20 000, 30 000, however many subscribers you have so not only does this company uh, work with youtubers youtubers if you have an instagram account with some kind of following um a pinterest account twitter if you have a um, blogger website or, you know, like a blogger website where you blog things or whatever. Um, and then, what did I say? Pinterest, Instagram, blog, YouTube, um, Twitter, and I think that was the other five. It's, I'm missing one. I'm mi I know I'm missing one. So, let me tell you about this company, like I said. So, this is a website I wish I would have known about um a little bit quicker than i did but i want to share this with you guys because i think it's an awesome website for any of us upcoming youtubers you want to start like reviewing products on your channel or if you're looking for an extra way to make some income there have been plenty of times in my apartment where i have been like dead broke and i was like let me go apply for some campaigns see if i can get some a little bit of extra money and luckily thank you jesus it worked out you guys and i was able to get a little bit of extra money so i want to share that with you guys especially for all of my moms out there all my single moms you know like i said any youtubers that's following me or if you're thinking about becoming a youtuber or you have following on any other social medias so when you first get on the website it has this stuff so it's the dashboard which is your dashboard your offers campaigns so, so companies will reach out to you if they do it goes right here and offers campaigns um any of your favorite companies that you like to work with and then your media kit your media kit is like your profile you're telling them about yourself you're telling about your social media your youtube you're telling about yourself so let me show you guys how to make a little bit of extra money so once you click on campaigns it takes you to all campaigns now um some products i do comp i do do a review completely free especially if it's a product that i actually need and want if it's a product that i want but you know i don't necessarily need it then more or less i'm going to most likely charge that company to review that product now um you could do like me if you have been thinking about it or not thinking about it what i do is i have two different types of reviews i review where i will throw your product in front of a vlog or a video that i already plan on making or i would do a complete dedicated video now if you do a dedicated video i definitely say chart hey that's brandy y'all i definitely say charge more for a dedicated video most of the time when y'all see me reviewing um a product in front of a vlog either i'm getting paid a lesser amount or i'm not getting paid at all but like i said it's my preference i have the right to decide it just like you guys have the right to decide that so um, they have the easy campaign. These are all the campaigns combined together. They have the easy one, the freebies, the deals, and the paid. So the ones, the categories I normally look at is freebies and paid. So let me show you guys a freebie. So with freebies, freebies is basically companies telling you, hey, you know, you can review this product. It's going to be absolutely free. Like I'm, I'm not paying you anything to review this product, but you get the product for free. So they have different ones. They have the ones that say product cost, but you get it refunded, which means you have to pay for those first. And then they'll refund your money back. So let's click on that one. I don't know. Say your child loves squishy toys, because that's what it looks like, y'all. I'm waiting on the load. Brandon, I want to be able to hear me, mama. Why does it take so long? Okay, the internet moving slow. But anywho, so they say the product is $9.97. Basically, they're going to have you pay for the product, and they send you your money back. But you do complete a review. That, now, that's totally up to you because most of them won't send your money back or won't send your money until you complete the review. I normally, I don't do these. Um, I just don't. If a company reach out to me and they want me to review something, then you should give me that product completely free. I'm not going to pay you to review your product and then you pay me my money back. Because if they don't like the review or if you say one thing in the review that they don't agree with, you won't get your money back. So, that's all I want to say. Um, so if you scroll to the bottom right here, it has the product details that's on all the products that you find. It has information right here telling you guys about the product. And then right here it has some have campaign um, where they have prerequisites, basically stuff that they want you to abide by. Or, you know, you have to live in the United States to do this. Some you have to be in Germany, some you have to be in Ireland, United States. Um, some they have you have to be women, some you have to be men, some you have to have 5,000 followers. 
on any social media. Some you have to have 10,000. So some will have their preference. It's totally up to them. So right here, you can send them a, a message. I normally send either free collaboration or I do collaboration, depending on which collaboration I want to do. And then I put information about the collaboration, what I have to offer and send. I normally send my message before I apply for it or after I apply for it because I'm pretty sure there's a lot of other people who are applying for this stuff. But I want to kind of stand out a little bit. So that's my reasoning for sending a message. So here's all six, you guys. So you have um, your blogging website, your blog website blog website you have facebook you have instagram pinterest twitter and um youtube and you can choose which one you want to do like i said right here it's going to instantly say zero because you are in the freebie category you can edit your pitch basically edit and tell them about your um your channel or telling them what you have to offer i will review your product on instagram instagram i have twenty thousand subscribers i will review it for free but it says you will be refunded so that means you have to post it they have to see everything is done correctly. They have to see that you said everything perfectly before you get your money back. And then you can click apply. Normal. So they have some everything up there, you guys. They have um, home decor, um, office stuff. I'm going to show you guys the categories. So this right here is snorkeling and mask. It's completely free. You'll send them your message. Let's see if they have any. Uh, come on, computer. Okay, so right here they only want you to live in the United States. So they're not asking for much. Y'all, I could be like, uh, -uh you touched the screen too much. So you're gonna click apply. I'm trying to hold y'all with the other hand. So you will click apply right here. Sorry, y'all. And then whatever social media you want to agree to, if you want to edit, you just hit edit. And whichever social media you want to add up there, you can. Whichever one you want to take away, you can. So I didn't want to do Facebook, I want to do Instagram. Those are the ones I want to do. If they don't agree with that, the company won't approve it. But, you know, that's totally up to you. Um, and then it says right here, you will receive the normal cost of the item, which is $28.99. You're going to receive for absolutely free. And then you will apply. These are the paid ones. So you can choose whether right here the company is telling you, okay, I will pay $100 to $175. No, matter of fact, let me click on one I already applied for. This one right here. I want to get Brandy a new toy box. So this company, well, it's not showing. Okay, these are the same two companies. So I want to get Brandy a new toy box, toy chest. So right here is telling me that this company will pay me from 100, zero to 175. I want this. This is something that I want. This is something that I need. So I'm agreeing to by sending this little pitch. I'm telling them that I'm agreeing to. I'm agreeing to all of these social medias for free. So I mean, they have to pay nothing for me. I have my little pitch just telling them about my information. Telling about my channel, but I'm agreeing to do this absolutely free of cost. Or I can say, hey, you know what? I do want you to pay for it. I mean, I want to charge you for it. I can go in here and select whichever social medias I choose to do it on. And then I put my set amount. So if I want to charge $50 for each social media, I charge $50 for each social media. If I choose not to charge $50 for each social media, however I want to do it. If I want to charge $10 for Facebook and $100 for YouTube, I can do it that way. I'm going to edit my pitch and right here they have special instructions sometime where they'll tell you kind of information about what they want you to know and you select that you have read it some have options on what color they want you to what colors you can choose all of that good stuff right here it's telling me i would normally this this item would normally cost 209 dollars and 95 cents but they're going to send it to me for absolute free and if i have a dollar amount i want them to pay me for it they're going to pay me for it and then i'm going to check and i'm going to hit apply so I want to show you guys that I'm almost finished. I bet y'all like, girl. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to show you guys all of the categories of the items. Yes, Spooky. Go get your phone, I say. So here's the categories right here, you guys, that you can choose from. Auto, beauty, books and music, electronics, family stuff, fashion, food and drinks, um, gifts, health. Home decor, home and garden, that's home decor, medical equipment, men's stuff, office stuff, pets, services, toys. So, yeah. So, totally up to you. Um, you can get paid through the company. The company normally does cash outs on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. You can do it that way. Or some companies, they'll be like, hey, can I pay you through PayPal? Now, that's your preference. Most of the time when I work with a company and they pay me to do something, I haven't sent an agreement where they pay me before I complete the review. 
some maybe one maybe two i have them pay me after but if you want them to pay you before make sure if they're going to do it through paypal make sure they pay you all of that good stuff make sure your money clear first and then you complete the review now with them you basically once you complete the review and everything you have these little steps with the system they have like a call center set up to where not a call yeah like a call center set up to where they go in and make sure that you did all the tests you're supposed to do they go in and they approve it the company approves your review they go in and make sure okay the company did what it's supposed to do you do what you're supposed to do then they release your money to you when i say they release your money to you either on monday tuesday or wednesday i think those are the days check just to make sure because those could it may have changed, but I think those are the days. They send it to your PayPal. Once they send it to your PayPal, then you put the money in your account. So, yeah. But that's basically how it is. Thank you, Brandy. Thank you for letting me know. Once again, this video is not sponsored. So, I got my bonnet on. I'm looking, like, real comfortable. Because that's what I've been doing today. Doing, applying for some companies. Today, I'm kind of doing, like, a freebie day. So, basically, I'm going through different products that I want not one different products that i need um i'm going through and sending them collaborations to work with them for free okay y'all excuse the floor because the floor may be dirty here's brandy shoes right here so far that she can fit that i got in her pal those dante shoes over there and then here's the bag of shoes right here that i got so far so i got brandy and y'all see i won't see because she don't have no pants on i got brandy over there trying on shoes and then Dante, because he don't got no shirt on over there trying no shoes. <laughs> so, and then we're going to go through clothes. I need to see if Dante clothes are drying and dry anyway so that he can hang those up because I'm trying to teach him how to hang up his clothes. He did it last time, so this time he's going to do it again. So, he's going to hang up his clothes and then, let me see, nothing else if they dry not right now. Okay, y'all, so this is what we have so far. Bag of shoes, bag of shoes and clothes, a bag of toys. Dante is going through his bag right now. Brandy is going. I got another bag in Brandy's closet. I'm going through right now. So the spaghetti is done, y'all. Remember I told y'all yesterday's. Well, whatever that I did at grocery home, that I had um shredded cheese. Hold on, Brandy. That I had shredded cheese, you guys. Well, guess what? I don't. So no shredded cheese, but I thought we definitely make some progress. Um, I still gotta go through Brandy's clothes, and I'm gonna go through our clothes together because I'm about to go through my clothes. Yes. Okay, which ones that you don't want? To pick out the ones you want to put in your toy bin. So yeah, yeah, I gotta go through my clothes and Brandy's clothes. Which Brandy clothes is running in the dresser with my clothes, so I'm gonna go through those. So I'm gonna go through those after we eat our spaghetti. That's probably gonna be another two bag of clothes because y'all, I'm, I'm just, I'm purging y'all. All the clothes that I no longer wear, if it's clothes I got in my closet that was when I was a small size. If I'm like, okay, Britt, if you haven't worn them yet, most of the time, well, not most of the time, but the clothes I have in my closet, y'all, it's too small on me. I'm pretty sure they're out of season. And by the time I get back down to that size, hopefully God will bless me with some money so I can buy some clothes. But most of those clothes that's like smaller for me, they're out of season anyway. So why not give them to somebody who's a little less fortunate who can wear them now versus me just keeping them in my closet and just wasting space, basically. So I'm about to go through a lot of my clothes, just kind of. I feel like I'm, I'm starting fresh. I'm just going to go through all my clothes, do all of that good stuff. Go through Brandy's clothes. But I'm going to do that once we finish eating. So I got that food cooling off. And then I'm waiting on the bread. Matter of fact, I need to take the bread out. Take the bread out, y'all. And then, yeah, we're going to eat. We got a bag of trash that we already collected from Brandy and Dante's. Well, not Brandy's. Dante's room. I got to put Brandy, put Dante's. Put Brandy's trash in the bag as well, y'all. So I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm really making a difference today. I feel like I'm getting a lot done. Um, and I've got to wash up my clothes, my work clothes, and I got, and I don't have much work clothes anyway. But I still need to wash up the clothes I do have, and I need to wash up Brandy clothes. So I'm gonna do that soon. So yeah, y'all, just checking in, just letting y'all know what kind of progress we're making. We're not really making, not not really making, because we're doing a lot of, we're making a lot of progress, but. Haven't been doing much vlogging because I am trying to like focus on cleaning and getting that stuff together and just. Okay, you guys, so I'm officially on bag six. I know I'm not close to the door. Did you finish your thing out there? All right. So, just wanted to say this real quick because I know you guys are going to probably say this, y'all. For one, it is 78 degrees in this house and the temperature set on 72. Now, you guys are going to say this. If you got that trash out there. I'm gonna say this, Brit. Why not just throw your stuff on, like let go, or 
What's up the good website? What's up the website, y'all? Um Places to sell clothes. What's up the website? I'm not gonna tell daddy. No, 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 I'm talking about. I am on my way, man. I'm getting my phone and I was one talking. Places to sell your used clothes online. Ooh. Uh uh, Siri. Anywho, I can't think of the name of the website or whatever. But anywho, it's the online store online. And they actually sent me a, like a PR thing to work with them, but I decided not to. So anywho, the reason why I'm not selling my nails because I feel like some of my clothes like are dingy. Like I got a good use out of them, a good wear out of them. Because y'all, if y'all don't have, y'all haven't picked up like that. I don't buy me clothes like that. So a lot of those, what, Brandy? Right here? No, Piece of tissue, girl. I mean, piece of, um, what do you call it? The fry off your bear. Um, I don't buy me a lot of clothes. So, most of the clothes I do have, they're like really, really dingy. The ones I wear, they're really, the ones I have, they used to have, they're really dingy. There was a couple of them with price tags on it. But, instead of going through, like, selling them to somebody who probably got money, I'll just rather give them to Salvation Army. At least I know Salvation Army is going to sell them for pretty cheap. When I say pretty cheap, like, under three well under four dollars i know i got my dressy pants out of there for work i made four pair of dress pants you guys and i paid 3.99 for each pair of those dress pants so for me it just it's easy to give them to salvation army because at least i know somebody said afford them you know instead of, instead of selling them all what is the name of that dog on website y'all comment below because i know y'all know the name of comment below for me but